Jim Nichols would be Premier. The exclusive Seven News Reachtel survey found the LNP six points ahead of Anastasia Palaszczuk's Labor government. But the big winner is One Nation, with Pauline Hanson's party soaring in popularity. The major parties are feeling the political heat from One Nation. It's going to be a scorcher. Two-party preferred has Labor losing the election with 47% of the vote to the LNP's 53%. I'm not going to comment on the polls. But as expected, the wild card is Pauline Hanson's party. Please explain to me what populous, populous politics is. With more than 21% of people saying One Nation would get their first preference. At the 1998 election, it snared 21% of the primary vote and 11 seats in Parliament. More than 40% of people thought Queensland would be better off if One Nation won seats. Over 35% felt we'd be worse off. As for the party's founder... I've always maintained a ladylike uh, approach to politics. <laughs> Almost 40% found her unfavourable, mostly women. 37% found Miss Hanson favourable, mainly men. Look, when we come to the election, there will be a clear choice. A clear choice. Over 60% of people thought Anastasia Palaszczuk's performance was above average. 35% below average. 48% feel Tim Nichols is doing a good job, 30% below average. While Labor has already ruled out minority government with One Nation, that's not a promise Mr Nichols is prepared to make at this stage. I'm not going to get into the ruling in, ruling out game. Patrick Condren, 7 News.